This morning, it's minus 17 degrees, but a steady stream of people walk the bridge from Dartmouth to Halifax. At least 75 adults stride by in a 40-minute period. That's about five times more than a normal day. Nobody seems to be complaining. Actually, it's not so bad. Like, it's... I forgot how much fun it could be. I'm actually kind of liking the walk in the morning. <laughs> it's not so bad, but I do feel bad for people who have to walk farther. I like it, actually. I've always liked walking across the bridge. Maybe not in February as much, but it doesn't bother me. Bridge officials say they've seen a dramatic increase in foot traffic since the strike began February 2nd. 96,000 commuters have been affected. The bridge is over one kilometer long and takes 15 minutes to walk across. The bridge often sways and shakes. During rush hour, it's loud. And you're almost 200 feet up. Not a pleasant experience for those afraid of heights. Transit workers say the strike could last as long as a few weeks. The last strike in 1998 went on for five. So the novelty of walking to work could very well wear off, especially since there's more cold weather ahead. For Open File Halifax, I'm Hillary Creamer.